that she wants When I bring her tea It's coffee that she needs When I bring her flowers She says they look like weeds Hello, uh, Dax and Takumi here again, doing some uh, more styling for the Lindy Hop. We're going to uh, show you a pattern I like to use a lot in my social dancing, and it's really, uh, it's really good for adding a little bit of style on the 7-8 of an 8-count pattern. Um, what we're going to do here is first show you the format that we're going to be working in before we actually show you the stylings we're going to use within that format. One, two, three and four, five and six, wait, a one, two, three and four, five and six with two waiting. P this, this walking is where we're going to be doing our style. And then anytime you have a six count pattern, like a pass, one, two, three and four, five and six, style, a one, two, three and four, five and six, a little styling. We're going to uh, show you a few stylings right now on the 7-8, throwing in our styling, starting with the ball change, ball change. Second, we're going to move to the slip slot. Third, we're going to do the freezes, two eight counts of each, nice and slow. With the basic ladies doing a twist to emphasize your beginning of the footwork, men doing a rock step. A five, six, seven, go. One, two, three, normal styling, walk, walk. One more time three and four, five and six, walk. Next is going to be the ball changes. Boom, ba, boom, ball change. Oh, boom, ba, 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 ball change. And then the next will be slip slops. Boom, ba, da, slip, slop, rock. Boom, ba, da, doom, ga, da, slip, slop, boom. The next being the freeze, shagoon. Boom, ba, boom, ba, da, zagoon. Boom, ba. Excellent. Now we're going to face our partners and uh, try the same pattern, trying not to uh, change the connection too much, doing like slip and sloppy and stuff that goes crazy. We want to keep the hand nice and still, boom, and we can, we can kind of say, hey, I'm slipping to the left or the right, but we don't want to, uh, to really get out of control with it. The idea is these stylings could be done separately, more than together, and that's what I want to uh, emphasize. Okay, here we go. Ladies doing twists and uh, gentlemen, back rocks. A five, six, seven, go. Boom, bop with just the normal a walk. And then zagoon, bop, boom, ba da da da. Next, the ball change. Boom, ba da zagoon, ga ga, rock, boom. Boom, ba da, do, do, ga, ga, rock with the slip, slop, shoom, shot, rock, boom, boom, ba da, ga, zoom, ga, da, boom, with the freeze, boom, ba da, shaka, boom, ba, boom, ba, ba, shkoom, boom, ba, boom, ba, da, a, do. Okay, now we're going to uh, take our pattern and make it a little bit more complex. We're going to do a six count pass with an inside turn, boom, ba, da, doom, da, da, with the styling, and then back, boom, ba, ba, boom, ba, ba, with a little styling. Same pattern as before, adding the in, in the pattern we used, two of each styling using this uh, pass with an inside turn and a pass by the left shoulder without a turn to keep it going. So uh, once with counts, and then we'll demonstrate it with music. A five, six, seven, and one, two, three, and four, five, and six with a walk. A one, two, three, and four, five, and six with a walk. A one, two, three, and four, five, and six. Ga goon, ga da, doom, bop, boom, zoom, ga da, boom, bop, Boom ba da slip slop boom bop boom ba da slip slop boom boom ba doom shaka doom da zoom ba zoom zaga a five six now the drone zoom with the walk five, six, two, five, six, zoom with the walk I'm a drummer in the high jones back and when I'm in 
Crazy, crazy. This styling is called heel wheelies. We're gonna use it mostly for the guy. Girls, you're more than welcome to try and throw it in wherever you'd like. Uh, we're gonna do a brief warm up where pretty much you put, choose the foot of your choice. I'm gonna use my right, put my left foot in front of it, and I'm gonna practice balancing up so that I'll show you from the side that my feet are on a flat plane that go on a diagonal up. So um, grab a partner, and let's say Sarah's gonna help me out. She's gonna hold on to me for so I have support, and I'll practice going up and going up and see if I can hold this. And I'll see if I can turn, and I'll change feet, and I'll do the exact same things. So as you're practicing those pops, you can both go back and forth, and Sarah can try that. One foot in front uses me for balance. You really wanna focus on where your butt is and where your chest is and how you can manipulate those to keep your balance, okay? Then you do it on your own, and you just hold it. So technically, you've lost your balance here. <clears throat> as soon as your weight goes past the first third of your heel, right to there, my balance is lost and I'm stepping, which is why we have to adjust where our butt is to hold that in place. So for the guys, I use this when I'm turning the girl. Cross hand tuck turn, one, two, three, and four, five, six, boom, yeah? Or even if we do a windmill after that. And up. So it's, it's a way you don't have to jump, you can still be attached to the ground and just raise yourself up a little bit. Yeah? So I'll show you a couple other ways to put that in. Three, four. And pretty much the idea with this is where can you put it in that it doesn't mess with the follower, which is what really makes it a styling. And I came up with this after watching Cirque du Soleil in Los Angeles. And there's this guy on uh, crutches and he was floating but he was floating using his crutches and his feet. It was really cool. So it's like, wow, you could do heel wheelies, and you can, these are new shoes, but you can roll with them around the floor. So technically, let's say I'm leading Sarah down the line. I could throw that into the dance. Heel wheelies. I left home when I turned 19. By age 22, I'd made the scene. I'm the trumpet man in the Ike Jones band. And when I'm in the club, I'm on the bandstand. Now my story begins with a short introduction. Put a face on a place when the time of All right, now we're doing heel arounds as a styling. The styling comes from Carolina Shag. And uh, it's gonna look like this. We'll face you at the camera there. Cross our right foot over our left foot. And now we're gonna spin to our right as we do a heel around. Heels together, turn. You cross your right foot over, heels, and turn. Cross your right foot over, heels, and turn. And we'll do it with, uh, you can do it with us. We'll start facing away. We have cross your right foot over, heel around, and stop. Right foot cross over, heel around, stop. Right foot cross and right for cross. Sarah, you wanna lead us through the left foot? Sure, uh, step on your left, or sorry, cross over on your left, and this time you're gonna go the opposite way. Step your left, heel around. Step your left, heel around. All right, so putting this into the dance, for the leaders, I prefer to do it on the three, four of a swing out, or the seven, eight of a swing out. I'm sorry, five, six of a swing out. So we have, one, two, heel around, down. So that's taking the place of the triple step. Your regular swing out. One, two, triple step. And now, one, two, heel around, five, six, seven. On the second half of the swing out, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. I do six, seven, eight, and I hold, and then I do my one. So check out these two combined. One, two, three. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. Five, six, seven, eight. For the followers. 
All right, followers, you're going to be doing the same count. So you're going to come in on one, two, three, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And it almost looks like a swivel when she's doing it, which makes it really cool. Yeah? Girls, you can also do it anytime you're spinning, right? So if we give Sarah a free spin, she can heal around it. Or if we do a lead spin, like a tuck turn, and putting together the two stylings on this video, she can do a heel around and I do a heel wheelie. Whew. Looks sort of cool that way. So, we're going to dance it for you with some music and you can check out different ways of using heel arounds. Now I lived home when I turned 19. By age 22, I'd made the scene. I'm the trumpet man in the Ike Jones band. And when I'm in the club, I'm on the bandstand. Now my story begins with a short introduction. Put a face on a place in a time of corruption. That club that I mentioned, it went up in flames. And the sign on the corner is all that remains. That night. I lost my job that night. I was unemployed that night. You know, a fire destroyed the rhythm club in that chair. Now, Jesse May was.